Chalawa. Well, praise the Abbas from Yosha. I don't want to see the past of that great millstone. Um, London sky goes eerie dark in second day of storm. Ophelia does phenomenon. So uh, today, earlier today, uh, down there in London, they had, um, the, in the daytime it was dark because of the hurricane that hit Northern Ireland and, and parts of England. The, uh, yesterday, it, the skies were orange and the moon was red. And then the next day, look, it says London was shrouded in darkness again on the second day of a dust phenomenon, which they're calling it a dust phenomenon. You know, they're just trying to put, Esau's just trying to offset it with all, oh, just dust from, Af from the deserts. Anyway, Sky Watchers described the atmosphere as apocalyptic, as disrupted weather systems from the storm tin the clouds above a capital. Because above the capital, a dark sepia colour. So, the skies went dark, man. These are omens, signs in the heavens, omens. One London described the atmosphere across the city as spooky, and several commented that it was akin to a partial eclipse. So it was in a broad day and it was just dark. The skies, the day, one of the day, it was orange. So as the London sky turned sepia, new Piccadilly lights switched to a sandy orange color. Um, so, I mean, people have submitted different pictures. So there's almond signs in the heavens that hurricane killed people. Now you got hurricanes coming all over the place, just hitting random places, the Caribbeans, Hitting four or five islands in one go, hitting up Florida's, hitting up England, Northern Ireland, Ireland and England. I mean, you, you, that's the Lord speaking. The scripture says the begin, the beginning of wisdom, the fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. So that's showing you that we're in a we're in serious time here, mate. It says uh, journalists. Gianluca Mezzofori shared images of the Piccadilly Circus billboards lit up against a dark sky. On Monday, skies above London were tinned orange after dust from Africa and Southern Europe was pulled by the storm. So, there you go. There you go. Now, they've got pictures and stuff. Look at that, man. 1 p.m. And it was dark. Now the experts are trying to come and say, okay, well, you know, um, due to the... You know how Esau goes on, man. People are coming out by the droves to see, this is signs in the heavens. We read that, we read that. So people are submitting these different images and stuff like that. Let me see if, if I can... I'm just going to load them, because I tried to do this earlier and I wasn't getting no luck. So these are some of the images, you know, just look at that. Broad day, the sky is looking like that. You know, then there's the orange and then there was the dark. So, guys, <laughs> I was going to flip and say, uh, you got that guy, um, well, you got, you know, you got to keep them eyes peeled, man. The scriptures tell you that. Let me get that in the scripture next. So I'm just... Documenting this because this is all part of it as well. Uh, Luke, and we had the red and this red sun. Where am I at with this? Right. I am come to send fire. Um, Actually, that's not what I want. Yeah, one sec. <clears throat> Luke twelve forty. No. Uh, where was it at, man? I just had it. Uh, I'll find it. This is it. Luke twelve thirty seven. Blessed are those servants whom the Lord, Yahweh, shy when he cometh shall find watching. Verily I say unto you that he shall grid himself and make them to sit down to meet and will come forth and serve them. 
also required to be on the watch. And, um, you know, the apostles have been watching for how many years? And um, we're watching as well. And that's what we're required to do. Blessed are those servants who when the Lord, when you come, shall find watching. So you call yourself a man of the Lord or whatever. You want it, well, your job, one of your jobs is to um, watch, you know. So that's that, that's that. Let me jump down to Luke 12 and 40. Be ye that re therefore ready also, for the Son of Man cometh at an hour when you think not. you got to be prepared for when the Lord's coming. That's why you got to be watching, because you don't know when he's coming. But you got people that are just not they've left the truth or saying, you know, let me pursue my uh, career goals. Well, when you ain't you ain't even, um, well, you ain't on your watch. So when the Lord comes, you're going to get fucked up. Okay? That's as simple as fucking that, mate. Yeah. So that's why you gotta be a diligent servant. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, so, I mean that that's another lesson. But anyway, I mean the thing is, is about you got these signs going off, man, and you know, and he's all she's being the devil that he is. He's trying to offset it. Oh, it's just a bit of dust. You know. So darkness, the red, the red sun, the uh, the darkness and the and the and the orange skies. Talk about signs. I mean, one of them was just red as hell right there. Look at that. And they just said it was in Worcester. Worcester's near me. And um, basically, you had a lot of winds, man. Heavy winds over that part. And it was fucking windy, man. You had this one old cat that wanted me to help him cross the street. It was that windy. I was some random dude, you know. Anyway, here it says um, it's London already. Look, night in at 4 p.m. Look at that. Okay. Luke twelve and thirty nine, and this not and this now know that if the good men of the house had known what hour the thief would come, he would have watched and not had suffered his house to be broken through. Be ye ready also, for the son of man cometh at an hour when you think not. So if you don't know we're in the end times, um. Mate, you, you 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 must be on fucking horse tranquilizers. And 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 to be fair, mate, we ain't got no business. I ain't got no. I ain't gonna talk to you niggas, man. Anybody that ain't you in this world and you're and you're um you fucking have, having a laugh out here, uh, you can fuck off, mate. Cause I I don't want to have a chat with any of these individuals, man. We're about this work, pushing this, and the men, the men that are that are, um, are pushing this work too. Great millstone, you know, to grind. Mill, you know, work to you know grind, grind mill and stuff like that. That's putting in the work. All the and and spiritual conversation, man. The scripture talks about that too. So, you know, all you fucking worldly fox. You're gonna see, man. That's that's why these phenomenons are happening, and you don't even know, man. You don't even know what's going on. Anyway, I'll be here uh, next round, but I'm just I just brought it out because I know. I... Actually, let me jump down to this Luke twelve forty three. Blessed is that servant, whom his lord when he cometh shall find so doing, because bro, this is opening up, man. And I I didn't even know I was gonna read all this. I didn't know I was gonna read that. I was actually going to try and find. I was actually going to find read the scripture about the signs in the heavens, and this come out so it just shows you how important it is to be a, to be um, involved in the work because these prophecies are speaking.
the Lord ain't lying. The Lord told you what's going to happen. You know? So that's what it is, mate. So with that, I'm going to say shalom.